spiritual. Can you briefly talk about your faith and how that plays into your family and your, your job now? Yeah, that's the most important thing to me. You know, my faith and foundation is firmly in my relationship with Jesus. He just is. And my mother was a Christian. And she begged me to go to church growing up. And I didn't want to go. I wasn't interested in it. My mom used to always say that Jesus had a plan for me, plans for a hope and a future, plans not to harm you, plans to prosper you, Jeremiah 29, 11. And at the time growing up, I didn't understand it and I didn't listen to it. And when my mom passed away two days before my junior year of high school, I grew a tremendous hate towards God. And for the two years that I was here at Carolina, the same way. And the reason being is I just couldn't understand all the things that my mom was telling me about Jesus loving me and having a plan and a purpose for me. And I didn't understand any reason why he would take away my mom. I'm 50 years old, and I miss her more now than I did when I was 16 when she passed away. She didn't get to see me run out of that tunnel. She didn't get to see me play here. She didn't get to see me drafted. She didn't get to see me play in the NBA. She didn't meet my wife. She wasn't at our wedding. She, she hasn't been with my kids. She's not physically here today. And one of the things that Coach Smith used to do was to make all the freshmen go to church. And as I went to church, only because Coach Smith and Coach Guthridge encouraged me to go to church, I started to understand what my mom was talking about. I was started to understand the sacrifice that Jesus has made for me and how much he loves me. And two days before my junior year of college, I became a Christian. And instead of being upset that Jesus has taken away the most beautiful person in my life and my mom, I'm thankful every day that he gave me the best mom that I could ever have for 16 years. She's here. She's here. She's here every day. The way I try to meet, treat my wife, she's here every day. The way I try to treat my children. And so my faith in Christ is the foundation of who I am. And when I say that I will walk this path in my own shoes and my personality, my own shoes and my personality is my faith. We're going to have to